good morning and welcome back to my channel my name is Gemma and I'm losing weight following the slimming world plan today is the 21st of January and we're up homeschooling Alex is joining us downstairs as well because we got a message from his school to say he's only been at 50% of his lessons so I trusted him upstairs um, he does say it's a fault um, and he has been at the lessons but we'll see so he's downstairs in my office, Kayla's on the table and um, I'm just doing myself some bacon in the active fryer. Fancy something substantial so I'm having a bacon egg sandwich. Um, obviously I'm filming what I eat today. And then I'm not sure for dinner. Um, like I say, the scales have not been moving as quickly as I'd like. So I'm trying to pull it back from maintain at the minute but whether I achieve that or not I don't know. Um, we managed to get some veg yesterday so that's really good. Um, Tesco had some broccoli in so that'll keep us going till Saturday um, to get us delivery from Tesco if anyone has any Tesco mustaves let me know because um, it's not somewhere I generally shop at um, but yeah if you if you know anything that's low sin quick wins um, let me know so this is breakfast this morning I've got three bacon medallions two um, of the Morrison's bread for my healthy extra bee and an egg and then I've got half a sin of ketchup just to let you know that because a few people have messaged me about bacon bacon is totally sin free still as long as you cut the fat off they've started sinning the medallions because a lot of the medallions still have the white fat around the edges but as long as you cut that off it's totally sin free I've checked that with my um, Slim and Will consultant and she's confirmed that so I need something quick and easy today so I'm having six sins of Kellogg's Corn Flakes and some semi skim milk. So I'm on six and a half sins for the day so far today. So I've finished work and it's been a long day. <laughs> bit bit tired now. Um, really busy um, with homeschooling today. Making sure Alex were on lessons and Kaylee had quite a lot to do and then she had um, a live class at quarter past one which usually we finish for 12 we do everything but because she had this live class I've had to sort this afternoon's workout as well because she's had to do some more work so yeah and work's been so busy hence why I only had cereals because I sorted kids dinner out um, and I just didn't have time I needed to hurry up so um, yeah I just had a roll of cereals um, I just want to have a tide around the house because it's looking a mess, you know, we've just not been able to do well, we've been busy and then with the next bit of tin bit time we get to night time so I've been taking painkillers and like um, settling down in my bedroom and that, so we haven't really been doing much. Um, I were going to cook something tonight but we've decided to have an healthy chip shop so Steve He's still doing his calories, so he's ordered like a mini fish and a small chips and a small peas, but he's going to weigh them um, just to make sure what calories they are. I've ordered a jacket potato. And um, I did want some a little bit naughty, so I've ordered the chicken kebab, which is on a spit. My chip, I don't use any oil on, um, but I always count sins because you can tell there's something on them. Um, I used to count two sins but I really want to step it up this year and I think two sins were probably not enough for it so I'm going to start calling it four sins now just to cover my back um, and I've ordered mushy peas so not very speedy day have I had any speed at all? no, no speed at all um, but tomorrow I'm going to try and pack it in and then we've got a delivery coming on Saturday which I will film um, I put I've had a look and gone through, had a look on um, Google just to see if there's any kind of Tesco's mustaves for Slimming World. Um, I'm going to try some of their tomato soup because the tomato soup I like you can't do in my, slow, in my soup maker because I like the Irons type one and um, yeah it burns it. <laughs> You're not allowed to put beans in it. So I'm going to, I've ordered that, which is one sin for 400 gram, which I think is really good for a, a tomato soup. So <laughs> I suppose it all, it's all in proof of taste. So we'll see. And I've got a couple of their low calorie microwave meals. Just we as homeschooling and working um, long hours. It's just, 
it's quite convenient like tonight where I'm tired I don't want to cook I want to get my dryer emptied my dishwasher emptied and clean up um, on these kind of days it's good to have something quick and, and I know ready meals aren't for everyone and to me um, they're just they're just convenient and if you can obviously cook them and put loads of veg in them even better um, so yeah I've ordered a couple of them to try I don't know if I like them because I'm that fussy I don't tend to like ready meals but um, we shall give them a try so Steve's picking the chippy on up on the way home um, about quarter to five um, kids have finished school now so we'll see if I get any um, grumbling emails from school to say Alex hasn't done his work because I've seen him click on everything and he's sat down here with us which has been really awkward actually because obviously me and Kaylee are on the table and we're quite loud and then as soon as she's finished I go and log in my office so he was sat in my office and then he sat on here and it was too loud for him then he's had to go in the living room but we didn't have something to charge his phone that he's doing it on and we had to go and get adapter from so it was just a farce really but we could do a I don't know a little table or a little office table or something Bonnie's staring at me outside she's chilling out garden um, but yeah we'll, we'll get it sorted but I'm feeling I feel a bit exhausted today I think I'm, I'm like I started reading at night and because it's because I'm that tired I've just not I've just not been asked <laughs> and um I do like reading, so I'm a bit gutted about that. I want to like get my energy levels up. Um, my aim is to do some exercise tomorrow morning. Whether that happens or not is another thing. Um, she has been doing some live classes, but they're like at five or six. It's really awkward, you know, when we're finishing work and having to cook for kids. And because I do exercise in the actual... Um, sorry about that glare from there. Um... Yeah, I do exercise. I'm gonna stand up, is it? Yeah, I do exercise in the kitchen, so it's just a bit awkward. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try and get up tomorrow morning and do something. But I don't know whether that is why the scales aren't moving as quickly because when I do exercise, I do lose weight slowly. So I think normally that weight that I put on on Saturday would have dropped straight off, but. Yeah, but I'm still going to exercise because it does make me feel better. So I'll just have to face the scales on Saturday and just work from it. Um, I don't want to have Saturday off plan. The kids and Steve are having a Domino's on Saturday night. Um, I don't like pizza, so I won't be tempted anyway. So I'm going to kind of plan what I'm having. Or I might have one of those ready meals that I've ordered. Um, just so it feels like I'm cheating, but I'm not. So... Yeah, so that's the plan for the weekend. Do want to be totally on plan. I've just realised I've not ordered anything Sunday dinner. I need a chicken. I'll add that in a bit. Um, so yeah, I just want a really good weekend. Batch cooking wise, I think I might do a corned beef ash because I've only got chilli in at the moment. I've got rice pudding already batch cooked, so that's all right. Um, and I do want to try a new recipe this week. I know I keep saying that, but... Yeah, but I'm really happy because I tried those um, potato things last night, potato skins, which were absolutely gorgeous. So it just varies with potato a bit with me being a potato eater. So um, yeah, I've, 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 I have enjoyed everything that I've eaten this week. I've still got some food left over. We've still got um, salmon that beef and red wine gravy that were on my shopping haul um, and a couple of chicken fillets but I think we're going to have the chicken fillets tomorrow because we'd already worked out calories and we're having them with um, this jar of sauce and it was Tony, one of my subscribers sent it me just, I think it was just before Christmas actually um, I'm surprised it came intact to be honest because it's a glass bottle but it's from, um, I think it's, she said Sainsbury's See, there's not one around me. It's not somewhere I shop. Um, and it's Taste the Difference, Puccini and Portobello Mushroom Sauce. Oh. But it's 12 cents, but it's 12 cents for a lot. And I, Kayla, won't eat this, but me, Steve and Alex love like a mushroom sauce. And it just looks so nice and rich. So I thought that we, um, I've got some butter mushrooms left. So 
And that's the only mushrooms I've got, or so I would have had a breakfast this morning. So yeah, butter mushrooms, onions, chicken, and that sauce. And then I don't know whether to just have veg or cauliflower rice or something like that, or like have a jacket tater or something with it. But I'll decide tomorrow when I see the scales in the morning. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get tidied up now. I've finished work, it's quarter past four. Got half an hour before Steve gets back, so I need to have a tidy up. This rug needs overing. Um, it's got Bonnie's dog hairs all over. She's a scruff pot. Um, need to tidy my window seat up because I keep putting all kids' school work on there and it's just a right mess at the minute. So I'm just gonna tidy up and um, that should make me feel a little bit better. But I am thinking that something needs to give because I feel like at the minute I've got too much going on. And like I had a chat with Steve last night and he thinks that I need to stop with boxes. But I don't know, I were enjoying doing them. Um, but it's like I work and obviously I've got this channel so um, I don't need to be doing them. And the end of year bit, doing your tax return, is really stressing me out. Because obviously you're buying constantly chocolate and you're supposed to do your like income, your expenditure. So I need to record everything I buy. And as you can imagine, selling quite a few boxes a week, that's a lot of stuff. And and it's just stressing me out. And we're quite, we're all right with money, do you know. I mean, obviously we're not well off or anything like that, but we're comfortable. So I feel like it's causing me more work than I need to be doing. Do you know what I mean? Because I'm homeschooling two children. Um, we're living through a lockdown, so I shouldn't be going shopping for, for stuff anyway. And then I'm having to do this tax return thing, which is just stressing me out, because I've never, ever had to do that before, obviously being employed. Um, I've never done anything self-employed, so it's, and, and I've tried, you try phoning HMRC, and they won't answer and then you try and message them but you can't and then oh it's just yeah anyway <laughs> so yeah th i'm thinking i might stop doing them and then at least it'll give me my weekends free um but we'll see i might change my mind but at the minute i feel like i want to concentrate on getting my weight off i want to concentrate on exercising i want to make sure the kids are completing the work which obviously I haven't been on ball with that message I had yesterday thinking I could trust our Alex. He still says I can, he says it were an issue but I don't know, it's just something back in my mind so um, I'd like to think I can trust him but I don't know. Um, so yeah I've waffled on enough, I'm going to get tidied up, have a drink and um, that's it yeah. So I will catch up with you all soon. This is tea tonight. I've got a jacket potato, some of the chicken meat and mushy peas. And like I said, I'm going to class it as four sins. So this is what I'm going to have with my final sins. I was thinking I weren't going to have something, but I just can't not have something sweet. So um, good down plan, but obviously I've not had any speed food and tea was kind of guesstimating. But I think I've over egg sins um, and I only had about a quarter of that chicken meat. Our Alex had some, Steve had a little bit, and then the rest were thrown away. Um, so this is four sins. I had the half sin with my ketchup on my bacon sandwich this morning, and my healthy B. I had cereals with my healthy A and six sins, so that was six and a half. And then I counted that T for four, so ten and a half. So this is me finishing on 14 and a half sins. So yeah, good day. I am contemplating doing my version of an SP day. Um, tomorrow but we'll see how it goes when I wake up um, Steve and Marie have just been working out what they're going to be having from Domino's they've printed out all calories um, so that they don't have to ruin their diet this weekend um, and I'm going to have a think about what I'm going to have so thank you so much for watching I hope you've enjoyed the video if you have please give it a thumbs up and um, drop a comment below and if you're not already subscribed it would be fantastic if you could so thank you very much bye